Good afternoon, everyone. Welcome to our person at Press Thompson, Ryan Mason, after our game against Leicester City. Please raise your hands and try to get to as many of you as possible. Who would like the first question? Any hands raised? Can't see any hands raised at the moment. Ah. <laughs> As to go. Okay. Hey there, Ryan. Congratulations on that final performance of the season. What did you make of it? You must be delighted to at least sign off in style with a bit of spirit as well. Yeah, yeah, I thought so. I thought the second half we, we were excellent. I thought in the first half as well we were very good. Obviously disappointing to concede two penalties. Um, but listen, I have to... Sorry, first, yeah, I just want to... I want to dedicate that win to Simon Bamba and his family. Incredibly... Loved at this football club. We lost him a couple of days ago. So I'm sure he's looking down on us and he helped us today because the last 10 minutes we we showed immense quality um, in those moments where there was big pressure. We felt the pressure with with their fans as well. Um, we felt that energy within the place. Um, and uh, I thought the calmness we showed, the desire, first of all, to run. Every one of those players on the football pitch today wanted to run. They wanted to compete. They wanted to fight together. And, and when you do that, you, you have a chance. And um, like I said, I thought in the second half, we had some moments of immense quality. Hi, Ryan. Can I ask you uh, your thoughts on qualifying for the Europa Conference League? And also, um, is there any frustration in the way you played so well in the second half that... You've almost missed out on the top six. When you, and how do, you, how do you explain that when you can play like you did at the end? Yeah, I mean, first of all, we, we want to be in the Champions League. Um, I've said all along, it's disappointing where we are. In this moment, it's very disappointing for the football club. Um, it's important we're in Europe, um, not the European competition we want to be in. Wednesday night was a massive dent for us. Um, I said that after the game. The most important thing to come to do today was to come and win um, at a very, very difficult place to come. And I thought we'd come here and we not only won, but I thought we deservedly won. Um, I felt like we were the better team. Um, I felt like we was in control. And like I say, we had some real moments of quality. So it was important we finished today with a win um, for many different reasons. Yes, not the competition we want to be in next year, but it's a European competition and... We'll, we will respect it, that's for sure. Hi, Ryan. Um, Gareth Bale obviously made a tremendous difference. In, sorry, can you hear me? Yes, I've got you. Sorry. Um, Bale obviously made massive difference in the second half. Has he done enough to earn himself a second season back at Tottenham? It's not, I'm not going to speak about individuals on, on this summer, next season... The football club, we need to appoint a manager first. Um, but in terms of Gareth, yes, he, he produced moments of brilliance. And I've said all along that Gareth won't lose this. He, you don't just overnight lose that ability to, to produce moments when you're that good. He's proven it over a decade. And he's been excellent for me. Um, and he's been excellent today as well. I felt like he'd come on, he changed the game. He's finished some of the touches, some of the balls he played immense quality and I expect nothing nothing less from Gareth. Okay, we're going to go to Jonathan Bill. Jonathan. I don't know if you can hear me, I see uh, the different presentations going on. Um, can you talk about Aaron Payne? Obviously, we've been one of the gold and boots today. Can you talk about our biggest team on that is saying here three times now? I think it was about Harry Kane and the golden. Listen, Harry Kane um, deservedly won the golden boot today. Like I've said all along, I think he's, a, he's, he's, he's the best player in the Premier League. Most goals, most assists, I think it says it all. Um, I feel very, very honoured to have played with him. We had some amazing experiences together coming through the ranks and I've, I've been very fortunate enough as well over these past five weeks to have coached him, to have managed him. And he turned up again today. He, he scored important goals in important moments and showed moments of brilliance. So from an individual point of view, I'm very, I'm very pleased that Harry's got another golden boot to, to add to the collection. Okay, we've got no more hands up, so we'll conclude it there. That's for sure. 
some uh, take care. Thank you. Thank you.